I'm Jerry Graham. I'm owner of Graham Electric Planter. We're stir uh, based out of Sterling, Colorado. We're here at the farm show and we're featuring our electric drive, planter electric drives. Uh, last year we came out with a completely wireless system, brushless motor. Uh, has features, shut off, uh, variable rate, turn compensation. The variable rate is row by row for not only seed, but two liquid fertilizers and a dry fertilizer. Now this year we've upgraded our tablet. So this is a version 2.0 of our tablet. I'll kind of go through here. This will be your home page. So we go into configurations, do your GPS, language, metrics, standard. Go into planter settings, give your ID. You have to give each planter an ID since it's wireless, so we don't cross talk. You put in populations, just general setup. Go to planter geometry. So when you're setting up, everything needs to know where it is. So it's something the guys have done for guys with poor eyesight like I have. If you touch this, it actually tells you what to measure instead of following these little lines around. So we go on across, we'll have a fertilizer configuration. It'll be basically the same as a seed. That'll be done here in like a week or so. The row settings are populate. Gives you your uh, information on the rows as far as, so your shutoffs work properly. So we go back here. Uh, we have a diagnostics page set up. This is just putting your fields, uh, prescription stuff in. This is a dashboard. Right down here we have your monitor. This is showing your seed population. This line here is showing the RPMs of the motor. So you can kind of watch what you're doing on your uh, turn compensation and your variable rate row by row. Up here we have a summary when you're planting. It shows a field summary. If we touch here, it gives us our skips, doubles, and singles. We can go here and then we can monitor row by row if you think you're having a problem. Right here is uh, your shape files and as you're planning your applied maps will be over that. If we go on down here now this is our monitoring seed. If we're monitoring fertilizer it's going to show your gallons showing what each row is doing. We can do that for the two liquids. Come in here on a dry it's doing the same thing where we have motors on your dry units. And then uh, when you're planning, if you're not a, on a non-prescription, you have your seed populations entered in there. You can just touch them going through the field. Change your population manually. Be same with uh, um, fertilizer. Touch this button to prime plates. This is a jump button so you can start without leaving a skip. And that's kind of the overview of it.